Nick Jenkins. Um, I'm 65 years of age and I live just outside Cardiff. I've been a professional photographer for about 18 years and I run photography courses, workshops, I do photography for commercial companies, I do photography for calendars and I also do greetings cards as well. So really it's very much about landscapes, outdoors and my passions are going to be the coastline where we are today and also places like the Brecon Beacons, the Yorkshire Dales, the Lake District, anywhere really which gets me away from people if that doesn't sound a bit bizarre. Photography for me really brings out um, a level of emotion, if you like, that perhaps I hadn't experienced before, or if I had, I wasn't necessarily aware of it. The, the ability to be able to capture that in a way that makes you feel that you're capturing not just a picture, but perhaps an emotion, a story behind that picture. What is it about that picture that caught my attention? What is it that caught my eye? Why was it so important to me? And that really, I think, is a spur, a driver, which takes you on to the next level of interest and you think, I've done that, I can do this. Photography is for me. And that then will slowly allow you to improve your standards, improve your skills and get to the next level of photography, which perhaps is a couple of steps above. And then you start getting your confidence and starting to realise just what a fabulous product the camera can produce but never forgetting that that product is only produced on the back of your imagination and your creativity when you're looking at that. About nine, ten months ago, I was driving through the Forest of Dean and suddenly spotted, this was in February, early morning February, shafts of sun coming through the trees. The trees themselves were black because they were in shadow facing away from the sun. I pulled over, got all my stuff out of the back of the car, hoping that this light would stay. It did, fortunately and I must have rattled off about 12 or 15 photographs. And that was an unplanned moment, but the consequences and the results of that 20, 25 minutes or so in the Forest of Dean gave me a range of pictures I'd not even ever seen before, let alone had a chance to photograph. So you never know what's around that corner, just keep looking. The older we get, and I'm no spring chicken anymore, but I love coming down to a place like we are at the moment, Atlanta at Major Beach. I like going to the waterfalls and the Brecon Beacons. There's something that makes you want to achieve that. There's a driver in the back of my mind that wants me to achieve. And to be quite honest, when I've got that buzz, I'm not worried about perhaps a pain in my leg or the weight of the camera. I'm there enjoying what I do. And when you're 25, you want to do everything. The world is yours. It's the way it is. It's the way it was for me, for sure. And as you get older, that will slow down a bit. But it should never ever, and possibly will never ever, impact on that one cherished hobby that you've hung on to all that time. For photography, I've been doing it for so long, off and on, not professionally, that I've stuck with it. And I've suddenly found that at my age now, I'm acting and behaving more like a 25-year-old than when I was 25. So the passion will stay, the enthusiasm will stay. And all together, you add all those factors up, and it's a fascinating thing to be able to get hold of and say, I took that picture. I thought of that when I was younger, but now I'm older. I went out and I actually did it. So there's an achievement at the top of all this as well, which will really be something to strive for.